Hey folks, welcome back, I'm Daily Fix, and we are going to continue with our French campaign. Now, I'm still trying to balance out my audio and stuff like that, and I actually got it to a point where I don't need a headset anymore. I actually got a few boxes, so hopefully not going to be an too annoying, but it's, it's trial and error, it's trial and error, guys. So, uh, I've been talking on YouTube a bit on what to do and uh, Matthew has helped me and he said you know you start declaring war on everyone take their money just start ruining them financially and this way you get all of those truces we can go into the Genoan here conquest um, and I also just realized that Lorraine is having a weak claim Duke so he could we could go and PU him but uh, if you see this, then that is not good. And we need to make sure we get those claims up and running. Now, we have a few here, like Lee H. And we'll have to wait for three more days to see what the outcome is going to be. So, if we declare war on Lee H, Austria, Archen, Cologne, and Munster will join. Which is actually quite good. We'll go with uh, with cleansing of the heresy wheel. We will not do this. Uh, but Cologne and all of that. If you look into our aggressive expansion. Uh, you can see that Cologne is having a lot of it. And just getting these out is not a bad idea. Also what I want to do is move my trade capital here to London. And this should help us. Because we have the most trade power here. 32. Uh, I was just checking. And yeah 32 is definitely the majority of it. So looking at trade, this should go up even more. Um, we are also still rooting out... Where are you? There you go. Uh, these fellas here. So let's split you up. You go there. Uh, we'll bring those back because we will need them. And oof, that is a lot of money here. Oh, not liking that. But I will probably just do this just for the development. What I don't like is the burgers gaining influence. Speaking of that, yeah, definitely, I will have to, well, the unrest is not that annoying. We're not developing the unrest. Oh, I will do this one. Um, let's go over to our estates, because I've not looked into those for a long time. Uh, once those rebels are out, we're going to be taking territory away from them. Um, they're still happy enough to do this, and eventually we'll just definitely, we want to do this before... Age of Absolutism starts. Uh, is there still... Yes, there are. There are still annoyances in our lands. You go there and you go... You know, you go sit over in... Paris. Yeah, Paris. A good place to call home. For the French, that is. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, mercenary company become unavailable. We'll accept those. For sure, we'll have to root this out. We could also let them just deal with it. Uh, we don't necessarily have to do this ourselves, uh, but we are going to. Now, we have 27 ships. Uh, actually, no, we'll do this. The You can go over here, actually. We also want to start annexing Finland the second he starts those claims, because he is just wasting a lot of time. And I don't like that. We're supporting air. We are improving relations. And the second we are... Back in our own territory, we will start the conquest. We're actually now making a shit ton of money. Oh yeah, look at that. We were at 14, guys. We were at 14. So that is absolutely amazing. We do have to reform this. So that's going to be something. We're going to be paying off our loans. And the second we have done that, we are going to um, increase our estuaries. We've not done this it's definitely a mistake on my part. I'm sorry for that. And we're going to be taking a look. If our guy gets on the throne, I would like to uh, claim their throne. Um, but right now, we can do the royal marriage over here because he has a weak claim. And would that bring us any more over? Let's see. We're already losing one. A Genoan military axis. Okay, let's start with that. Let us um, cancel the military axis over here. Uh, we still have one over. So, annexing one of our subjects would not be such a bad idea. We'll keep Scotland. Finland we can do, but I'm thinking about annexing Norway. 
since he is not doing anything. Let's take a look at the financial situation of our subject here. Uh, Scotland, no debt, which is good. Uh, Savoy, we need to improve. He is, um, he has no liberty desire, so that's good. He hates us, but he is doing fine. We're going to be siphling income as well. Actually, no, we're going to be doing this one. Divert trade. And everyone on aggressive, please. Novgorod. No debt. Get that money towards me. Norway is having debt issues. Maybe this is why he is not transforming all of that. So are they still making money? Would he make money? I think he would. Yeah, there's almost nothing out of... If he's going to dive into the negative, we want to change this. And uh, Naples is... Enable embargo rivals, that is definitely good. Is there anything else that we want to do? They have a debt, which we do want to pay off, because they will need to start building up troops. How is Finland doing? Finland is starting to have a debt issue as well. Enable embargoing rivals. Uh, we can knowledge share. We'll do that. Uh, we have to pay this off. We'll have to pay this off. So let's take a look here. Um, oh, oh well. Not the best. Not the worst either. Okay, stop. So you should be done as well. Uh, once they're here, we group them up and we start moving them back. 27 ships we have. And we want to build up more heavies as well. But at least we're making money, which is new. Usually I will lose money and people are starting to get grey hair out of it. <laughs> I'm sorry for that. Really, I'm sorry for that. Uh, the English, not a threat anymore. Those guys are gone. We could lower army maintenance, but we know we'll be fighting shortly. So we're still waiting here for about 4,000 troops. So we're getting a, oh, about 1,200 each month. Uh, so we'll just take a bit slow, a bit of time here. A bit of time we'll take. So we can just do... Mm, yeah, one more on our subjects. No, no, don't, don't do um, Finland. He loves me already. Uh, you go to Norway. So what I'm wondering right now is we did pay off his, his debt. Would he start converting to Protestant? Because I'm not seeing it. Is this really that important territory? There is a level 2 trade port here. They will uh, level these up for you. So having those is not a bad idea. Hmm... Also, Novgorod is having issues with this. It's just too strong a territory. That's why I really don't want this. There we go. See all of this. Missionary strength, negative 5. He is unable to convert. That is his problem. He just, he just can't. Oh, well. Uh, group you guys up. And I would like you to go over to Den Haag. Why not? 27. So he has to go another time for 3k. Conversion has been successful. I love that message. I really do. I know this is uh, the most boring part for you guys, where I just convert territory. Um, but it has to happen. We're converting this one. This one is... Building a courthouse. Apparently, you can just build or convert. Strange. Uh, this is the same province, so... Go here, then. Uh, courthouse is going to be quite important because we are very much over our governing capacity. Uh, I was building those up, but we'll uh, focus on debt issues and then we'll do the rest. Uh, we can also stop paying for these forts. Can I get more reinforcements? Uh, we're at 3.85, which is not a whole bunch. Uh, what is this? So the Irish Protestant, the commander, is a level 2 half-priced discipline guy. 
Admiral becomes available for duty. I don't care about that. Or gain prestige. Well, that level 2, half priced. Very interesting. Go take him. We're still making money, so hey, why not? He is about as expensive as the rest. The average claim guy, still not particularly interested in that. And we'll save up on admin. Uh, it will cost us 382, so that is about 800 that we will need. So we're halfway there. So just taking a bit of a breather here is not a bad idea. Uh, my ships will go and you are not doing jack shit. Why are you not doing anything? That's dumb. Uh, Genoa. Yeah, let's go to Genoa. We'll to put this on. Getting an Admiral in here for the uh, trade is not that bad. We could make... There we go. Like 10. 10 free. That is good news. That is absolutely good news. But we want to definitely start... Adding this one towards 10. Because at 10, I believe, we'll get a new idea group. It's going to be economy. Uh, I was... Very tempted in going into, say, exploration. Uh, but my economy just is so bad that I will need to uh, change that idea. Uh, in this war, Austria is going to help. And we'll go with Liege. Austria is definitely in. Munster isn't. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Well, we are at war. <laughs> oh, man. Sometimes I'm so dense. Seriously. Uh, we'll wait, though, with those guys. We'll definitely want an army to or two to stay in here. I think we can definitely do this without those numbers. Um, no, we'll send one army up here towards Liege. Siege it down. And we'll send you towards Colon. Cologne or Colon? I do not know. Uh, my ships need to return. But can they? How many ships do they have? They have four lights, six galleys, and four transports. So I'd say we were, we're definitely on the safe side here. Uh, these guys are moving. You are going to stay here. Oh, I, didn't, I really did not mean to do this. Not with my current manpower. That's just a damn nightmare. Uh, we'll split these guys up. Send you over there. We know there is an army. A 4k army, so that's not a huge problem. And there is the military coalition against us. We will need to deal with that. Okay. You as well. Let's split you up. You stay there and the other 15 will go to loan. Um, this guy will remain in his position, and we're waiting for our ships to arrive. Uh, we'll have to siege those guys. We'll just take money. We'll not take territory, so the AI isn't growing. Danish separatist. Well, of course. How many? For independence, 10k. Can we harsh treat them? Yeah, we'll harsh treat them. I just don't need them right now. I don't need them in my life. Like, ever. So, Munster apparently took this opportunity to attack Utrecht. Interesting. I like that idea. Just you go fighting. There is the Kosh army going up. Can we send you over to that region? So, the second they're out, they are out. And we'll focus our attention on Austria at the latest possible area or time. You go over there as well. This is one stack. Ah, uh, what's going on? Just cause. Aggressive expansion impact negative 220. Oh, that is so annoying that I'm not taking territory now. Uh, we can open our, open our borders to all Protestants. We would lose church power. I currently have 28. That is not a huge deal. And we'll gain prestige. This is actually very, very good. Open our borders to all Protestants. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, we, we just lo lost a few points, which is, you know, not a big deal. There are some armies heading our way. 
Uh, we can actually move you over towards Trier. This guy will stay here. He's a defensive army. He will just react and see what will happen. Other than that, we're just waiting out. You go here and siege him down. There might be a fight here. I don't think it's happening, but this is his capital. And he's building up troops. Okay, let's group you guys up. So we got a bunch of 15 stacks everywhere. And definitely the most dangerous one is Austria. Which is on his way down. So let's go and meet him. He is, of course, fighting in Naples. Uh, Denmark has joined the coalition. That's not a... We will attack the coalition after this. Uh, we definitely want to. We don't want to give them too much time. Uh, 18 more points on Naples. Yeah, sure, why not? Just go ahead. We're just waiting here. Let's zoom out a bit and go in this region. Naples is over there fighting in the mountains. He is... This is my territory, so I will get a good positive too. Let's beat that army into the ground. Let's beat you into submission. Where are you going? Yeah, we might just go in here and just beat the Austrian armies. Okay, go here. Where do you think you're going, mate? I need a general with a good, a good maneuver. That would be so, so nice. So how is the... Into oh, they're all joining. Look at that. Trier, Trent, Saxony, Ragusa. Oh, this is now going to be a coalition war. Is that how it goes? Yeah. Okay, that is annoying. Poland did not join. Can I call you in? Okay, this, this could be rather, rather bad. Uh, I'm not saying I'm liking this. I'll be honest. We do want to get out of this war then. We'll get truces with everyone. Reversion has been successful. Let's go to our area over here. And let's put you on. I think this is the final one. And this is its own... Okay, so this is the region. And this is also Protestant, so that's good. Good news. Good news for us. Uh, let's see. Well, instead of focusing on this region, I would like to get these guys out then. Ragusa joined. Denmark didn't. Hey, as long as they're fighting in here, I don't care, you know? That's not that important territory. No, we will still go towards Naples. Even though Naples is not the best ally... Uh, oh, well. Come on, guys. Get those sieges up. Up and running. I want to start piecing these guys out. Uh, this one's going to be the first one, actually. So that's going to be nice. So there's not enough troops here to actually make a problem for us. Let's go in here. They will reinforce, so we need to... If we can be the defender on the hills or into the mountains, then that would be nice. Other than that, I will have to be very careful where to fight. Siege and Munster is done. He is at negative 15. And we'll go towards this region over there. Is there a zone of control here? Yes, there is. So you head over to... What's this country called? Effort. Yeah, okay, cool. You go there. Once this fort falls, they want out. Uh, without a doubt. They they will be out. Okay, where will we fight? This is... Hills. There's not a fort in here. We'll take uh, care of those smaller stacks here. There will be a fight. 6k with the Lorrainians, I think. Oh, just 1k. That's good as well. I guess. Uh, these guys are on the way out. Can we go here? Yeah, we'll we'll go in there. We'll we'll take the negative. Colon is done. Two for peace. All of your money, nothing else. Just go. All of your cash right now. And you go over there. Uh, we are slightly undermanned. Naples is not liking it. Oh well, it is what it is. Uh, we'll have uh, the fight over here. Austrians are heading in. We get a lot of negatives, which is not good. If the second they join, we want to get out. Can we do this before... Oh, no, we can't. Let's get out. Let's get out. 
I don't want to lose all of those troops. So, depth. We cannot repay it yet. We will, eventually. So these guys are going over there. Uh, gain corruption or lose money. I, I don't want corruption anymore. Uh, speaking of which, can we lower that? Just a tiny bit. No, I would like to increase it to 10. Uh, once the corruption is gone, that's going to be quite nice. Okay, those two are over there. These two are over here. Slow and steady, guys. Slow and steady. Just picking the fights. Try not to lose too much manpower. Knowledge sharing with Finland is done. Still making seven ducats. Which is good news. For a while. For, for, for today, it's good news. Hmm. Uh, once this one is done, he's going on Archon. Truce with Castile has ended. Okay. Oh, that could be bad. He definitely hates me. He has no aggressive expansion with me, but he could declare war on me. This could be like the spiraling down. <laughs> oh, that would suck. That would suck so much. Uh, we'll wait here for a tiny bit. Um, there's just too many troops here. Naples is doing the best they can. Well, we could send you... This is Austria. That is once uh, Savoy is done. That's good. Uh, we'll send you to Archon. Apparently, we cannot reach that due to this zone of control and no military access. Send you over there. Uh, we'll get those guys out. I would. I do hope that Trier yeah, is going to fall. Oh, there you go. That's what I'm talking about. They are still at negative 7. So we'll do it like this. We'll go here. We'll drop one guy. Oh, and Baden. Pause the game. Get out. Give me your cash. Uh, lose prestige or mill points. Let's lose the prestige. And you go over there. Still saving up. We're almost at 8. <gasps> Shit, I didn't see it. I didn't see it. Go back. Go back. Oh, that's so dumb. That is so dumb. Uh, go here. Oh, I'm an idiot. Should have saw... I, I should have seen that, but I didn't. Go. You're out. Uh, what else? Yeah, we'll have to go in full force. Uh, or just get Austria out. And then go for Ragusa and Durga. How many troops does Austria have? 60,000. Okay, we have to regroup a tiny bit. But we already are suffering quite a bit. That doesn't change. That is definitely unfortunate. Okay, religion is done. Wait, I didn't have edicts on? Interesting. Oh, actually, I do. Right over here. And that is being converted. Let's do the same thing over here. Re uh, reinforce that religion. And then France is almost done. And we'll go into Burgundy. Because we don't need those centers of reformation. Okay, you go here as well. You go towards Liege. That will fall right now. We can group you up and we'll start moving in. Getting good, good amount of money right now. I like that. There's Liege. That will give us a positive. Hmm. This is an army, right? Yeah, it's definitely this one. You go here, you go... You move over there. These guys. Apart from the 6,000 who's going to stay here. This is an army and this is an army. 
you head over there, you're still at full force, then you over there, and what do we want to do? The Austrians are probably somewhere, yeah, of course they're somewhere, that that's just makes no sense otherwise. Um, do we want to move in Austria? All of this would go in. We want to get this guy out first. Papal States has declared war. Liege is on low. Naples is on low. I think we need to attack um, Leipzig. Because this is uh, Savoy. And he's a vassal. So we send you over there. What is the capital? I can't see it. Oh, this is the capital. So we'll send one army over there. And this army also. So two armies will head over there. At least we have the war goal right now. And this is going to be annoying. That is definitely for sure. But we'll piece the majority out. Uh, once we get Saxony, it will help. And he's moving on there as well. So we've got two armies in this region. They will definitely be able to reinforce it. That's about 60,000 troops. Let's accept that. Making money again. Accept that. Rebel, uh, Danish rebels again. Uh, one of those armies will go over here and just handle the Danish rebels that will go over here. Okay, where's the other army? I kind of don't need one army in this region. I won't have two. Just to fight a self-defense against attacks from Protestants. So these are Catholics. Uh, the longer we can hold those guys off, the better. Uh, but we can still attack those with another one. I think Sweden will join in this coalition. But it's good that we deal with it right now. The longer the truces, the better. And we'll just make sure they start losing cash. And perhaps someone eventually will start voting for us. Hey, that would be nice. Uh, let's get the... I don't, I don't have the cash for this. There you go. You go there. And he's been sieged down all right, all swell. I think this, uh, yeah, they are. Gain score in Liege. There's a revolt now in... A more? Where is their damn revolt? Yeah, we'll see about that. We'll see about that revolt. Uh, this will be siege down, so we don't need two armies over here. There's the Danish troops together with... Uh, this is his territory. He could declare war on us. That is very true, but he won't. Uh, we'll keep those two armies next to each other. It's April. We'll wait till January. Hopefully this guy can go out. The more we can get out of this, the better. Archon is on medium. We want all of your cash. 35%. And there's Utrecht entering into that military coalition. That's because they think we are weak. And they, if they attack, they will have to fight Poland... Can we get the alliance back with you? Why do you bloody hate me so badly? Makes no sense. Oh well. Go here. There is that Danish revolt. Yeah, okay. We'll have to send guys over there. Uh, conversion has been done. Sweden entered the coalition. Let's see, where are we converting at the moment? I think it's this region. This one can go away, right? No, he is still working. But we'll have to deal with those troops. So one army, once he is done, he will go down here and make short work of those guys. There is the revolt in Amor. Come on, take it right now. Because these are Catholics, probably. 
What is your problem? What do you want? I they get heresy. Guess. Guess that's something. Ten years of separatism. Siege and Archon is done. Let's go deal with this. Then we'll deal with it, whatever is down. Deal there, please. Click this away. Archon. Get him out. You will probably have to go over here. But there's the Austrians as well. So let's not. Let's move into the capital of Austria. And he can join. This army can join. And we'll worry about those uh, rebels later. Okay, that siege is done. So we can now piece him out. And his uh, ally. 130. Negative 2. Go here. Just for a month. Give me that cash. Negative one. Another revolt. Man, I'm shit out of luck right now with those revolts. Uh, my ships are here. We'll go into London. There is the Austrian army heading um, actually my way. Not good. Uh, Castile has announced us their rival. That could be interesting. There we go. Set those demands. You head on over to Wenen. You head on over to that fort. And this guy will play defense still. 700 we've made so far. We're definitely making money here. Austria, Ragusa, and Trent. Uh, where's Trent again? It's down here somewhere, right? Revolt in Finland. Are you kidding me? It's like revolt everywhere. Bloody hell, I hate revolts so badly. You would not believe how badly I hate revolts. Uh, you guys head on over here and we'll uh, deal with the English separatist. Conversion is done. All of this is now ready. Uh, the edict here can be turned off. This one is being converted. This one is being converted. I think we want to get started here with London. We'll have to state this up. And we'll go with re reinforced religious unity. And we'll start with London. Quite expensive to get London this far actually. And we'll have to deal with the Austrians. But I'm thinking once we are sitting down his capital, he will start moving his troops back. At least that's what I'm counting on. Then we'll go towards the English Separatist. Use those ships, get into London. We'll have to work with two armies for now. Ooh, that is some good, good cash. That is some good cash. 650. Uh, do we want to assist? How far are we ahead on Miltech? Nine years. So we can definitely squeeze these two out. That's nice. Uh, anyways, that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.